Hi, I'm Meredith Hodges, and welcome to the Lucky Three Ranch Training Tips. Let's talk about vehicles. Cart and carriage design is very traditional, but whatever vehicle you plan to use, pay attention to two things, the weight of the vehicle and the length of the shafts. When first driving your young equine, it's best to use a light cart and an assistant. A young or unconditioned animal can easily strain his shoulder muscles if the cart is too heavy. The lighter the cart is, the less stress on the equine's body. Also, you should pay special attention to the distance between the shafts. The shafts should be far enough apart so that the animal can bend his entire body, not just his neck. They should also be long enough to reach the point of his shoulder while leaving ample space, roughly two feet, between him and the vehicle. Select a vehicle that pulls easily and is proportionate to your animal's size, strength, and conditioning. The larger two-wheel carts are very popular for driving classes, but make sure your equine is well conditioned before asking him to pull a heavier wooden cart. Stick with a lightweight metal cart you would use for training until he is fit enough to pull more weight. You might enjoy a two-person jog cart with motorcycle-style tires or a wooden Meadowbrook rear entry cart. For family fun, it's hard to beat a four-wheel Surrey or buggy. While there are many styles of carts and carriages for finished animals, it is recommended that you do your training with what's called an easy entry metal cart. It's substantially built with safety in mind, and the easy entry feature also means easy exit in case of emergency.